everybody, this is a video for anybody interested in hosting a house talk meeting for Extinction Rebellion. Whether you're an experienced rebel yourself or new and you just want to find out more about it, this video will just give you an overview of how you can go about organising a meeting. But for more information, click on the link below in the description. So first off, a house talk doesn't actually have to happen in somebody's house. So if you don't have a house available in which to host people, that's fine. You can find a space in a community centre, in a cafe, perhaps if you can book a separate room in the cafe, you'd obviously need to ask permission to do that. Maybe in a workplace, you could have one of these meetings at lunchtime, that would be fine. So connect with colleagues. And there's a number of reasons why people might prefer doing a meeting in this way. Some people just don't feel comfortable attending a large talk or meeting. And some people just can't make it for one reason or another. So this is a way to bring people together in a way that should be comfortable for everyone. So once you've got your venue organised, now you can go about inviting people. Now the meeting could take place at any time of day, so it might be over a brunch, lunch, at a dinner party, or just as a standalone event in itself. So, who are you going to invite? Well, it's up to you really. It could be friends, family members, colleagues. It might be members of the local community that you don't actually know very well. So, if you're doing it in a community space, then you could advertise the event with posters, for example, or by knocking on people's doors and inviting them in person. Otherwise, if it's in someone's home, then you'll probably just want to invite people that you know, so by word of mouth. So, when people arrive, Obviously make sure that there's enough seating so that everyone's comfortable and make sure that everyone's got a drink and something to eat if they want to. And then what's actually going to happen at the meeting? Well, the main event will be a talk or a video which will be shown. So when you click on the link below, that will take you through to the community information pack and that will have all the resources that you need. So in your local area, if there is a speaker available that can make it along and actually give a talk in person, then that will be arranged, um, which will obviously be a more interactive meeting. Um, if not, there's plenty of videos that can be shown, so you'll need to make sure you've got some kind of equipment on which to play the video. It doesn't have to be anything high tech, but some sort of computer or television that you can use with um, good enough sound quality for everyone to be able to hear. So at the end of the meeting, there'll be a chance for attendees to provide feedback, which the organiser can then put together and submit back to the um, community organisation team and receive email updates so they can then keep the others in the loop if they wish to be informed of what's going on in the local area. So hopefully you're feeling really motivated now to get out and organise a house meeting yourself and you might want to find someone to help you so you can organise it together. It might be that you want to organise it but someone else will host it in their own home and that's fine. Um, if you need some support please follow the links below to get in touch and ask for anything that we can help you with and this should be a great opportunity to bring people together to learn more about the climate and ecological crisis and Extinction Rebellion. So have fun organising!